Norwegian Cruise Line guests have been able to enjoy the small Bahama Island, a great stirrup key, for decades. If your next cruise has you calling this island, you're in luck. There's a variety of things to do and see during your time ashore, with some brand new amenities added in 2019 and 2020. I'm DB from EatSleepCruise.com, and to help cruisers heading to this private island, we've put together our list of the 10 best things to do on Great Stirrup Key. The Island Zipline Adventure is a brand new shore excursion offered on Great Stirrup Key. This one hour course includes a series of six zip lines, net bridges, and other challenge obstacles. At a height of 110 feet, you can soar up to 30 miles per hour to gain a whole new perspective of this private island. This is certainly a must-do activity for those thrill seekers out there. Just remember that closed-toed shoes are required to participate, so pack accordingly. Another newly added shore excursion, now offered by Norwegian Cruise Line, is the cruiser favorite swimming with the pigs in the Bahamas. From the private island of Great Syrup Key, you will board a boat for a scenic ride over to nearby Treasure Island to partake in this tour. Following a safety briefing and an introduction to the pigs, Guests will be allowed to interact with the animals. This one and a half hour swimming with the pigs tour is sure to be an Instagram worthy excursion. For those looking for a more tantalizing experience, you can spend part of your day at Stingray City. Just a short speedboat ride away from Great Stirrup Key, you get face to face with a stingray. Don't worry, you will be safe as the southern rays are used to interacting with people and the guides will instruct you on how to properly feed and approach the creatures. From there, it'll be time to get your underwater camera ready for some memorable photos to share on social media. If you want to kick things into overdrive while on GSC, then a jet ski tour is perfect for you. This adrenaline filled excursion includes about 45 minutes of time skimming the water. Your guided tour will take you around the island for some high speed thrills. If you'd prefer to reach new heights, you could opt for the parasailing tour instead. These five to seven minute flights will take you high above the island where you'll get a whole new perspective of Great Stirrup Key. Whether this is your first visit to the island or you've been there before, a self-guided tour of Great Stirrup Key is a great way to spend the morning ashore. There have been several updates recently, so take time to get acquainted with the island and explore all the new additions. You also won't want to miss all the photo opportunities along the way, including the new in-water swings. With a rival cruise line's private island, Lurking in the distance, there have been hints that more enhancements will be coming to Great Syrup Key in their near future. It's almost mandatory for you to at least dip your toes in the crystal clear waters during your visit to Great Syrup Key. Swimming areas are clearly marked for safety. For families or those who need assistance swimming, floating vests can also be rented. If you're looking for a bit more adventure, you can rent a paddleboard or take one of the kayak tours that give you a casual way to see the sea while visiting the Bahamas. With 10 acres of beachfront property, you're sure to find your ideal spot for a little R&R. &R. All the lounge chairs on the island are first come, first serve, so make sure to get an early tender ticket for the best choice of seating. Basking in the Bahamas sun is a fine way to spend the day. If you'd rather move your tanning session to the water, you can rent a floating mat to coast along the beach, or perhaps rent a clamshell to offer a little shade during your beach break. Are you ready to see what lies beneath Great Stirrup Key? Well, head off on your own snorkeling adventure to see what marine life awaits you. You can use your own snorkel gear or rent it from a stand on the island. Underwater Sculpture Garden is teeming with fish and playful statues for you to explore at your leisure. This is a self-guided activity, so feel free to make as many trips as you like throughout the day. There's also a catamaran and snorkeling excursion where you can escape the crowds to enjoy the underwater scenery off the coast of the island. You are bound to work up an appetite while ashore. Luckily, there are a variety of complimentary options for dining on Great Syrup Key. The Beach Grill offers a barbecue lunch featuring hamburgers, hot dogs, pizza, and other light fare with a new layout that helps to reduce wait times. There's also the Abaco Taco Stand. Located on the northern part of the island, this casual takeout window features beef, chicken, and seafood tacos with a toppings bar that allows you to customize each round. Additionally, Great Syrup Key now has its own food truck, which offers a select number of sandwiches, including pork, fish, and chicken. Great Syrup Key does not skimp when it comes to drinks. In fact, the island has several bars, including the Bacardi Bar and Patron Bar. You know what that means. It's time for a pub crawl. 
The best part of this trip is that there'll be no bar bill if you have the Norwegian beverage package. Yup, most alcoholic drinks served on the island are covered in your package. Just make sure to include a few rounds of water in between your margaritas, frozen cocktails, and rum punches. Want to really live it up during your day on this private island? Then upgrade your typical beach day to stay in the exclusive Silver Cove. This newly opened area on Great Syrup Key offers luxury villa accommodations, an exclusive lagoon, restaurant, and the Moe Bar. There are several different villas, including studios, one bedrooms, and two bedroom options. All villas come with AC, a television, a full private bathroom, and more. The pricing is per villa and not per guest, with prices varying depending on the sailing. And there you have it. That's our top 10 things to do on Great Stirrup Key. But of course, we'd love to hear from you. In the comments section below, let us know your favorite thing about this Norwegian Cruise Line private island. I'm DB from EatSleepCruise.com. And if you enjoyed this video, we'd really appreciate it if you gave it a big thumbs up. If you're just finding us for the first time, or have been watching our videos for a while and haven't gotten around to it, what are you waiting for? Make sure to subscribe to the channel and to also hit that notification icon. That way you get updated each week when we put out a brand new cruise video. You can also say hi to us all over social media at Eat Sleep Cruise. And thanks again for watching.